This is your forecast for the month of March 2017. This is a general reading for Libra Sun, Libra Rising, or Libra Moon. If you have a different rising or moon sign, you might find watching those videos helpful or more informative for you. Please remember that these are general readings and so they may not apply to everyone. If you would like a personal reading that is specific to you, please visit my website at thealchemistastrologer.com. If you enjoyed February's love readings, then visit my Vimeo site by clicking the link in the description box below. For the price of a latte, you can have access to your love reading for this month for your sign, for whether you're single, dating, or in a long-term relationship. Now, the final card for the month is a major card. So this is an important week. Uh, this could be a week where you you are having to be very temperate in whatever it is you're doing. Now, maybe you were ill, and so this could be a week of healing or connecting to healers. Uh, this is about, again, balance and finding that right mix. Now, maybe you're trying to thinking about how you can reconcile some differences. Either you're physically healing or maybe you're healing a relationship. Maybe you did act impulsively. Maybe you did say something you regret. And this is a week where you want to heal that. You're trying to find uh, the right way to go about things and perhaps a sense of proper timing. Maybe you were waiting and you feel that this is the week you know, where proper timing, the right time is important. This is the week to do something. There's also a focus, again, with fairness, which Libras are always concerned with harmony and fairness. So fairness is important to you. You, you want the right, um, again, the, that right mix, a fruitful combination, putting things together. And sometimes uh, this, this has to do with issues of compatibility reconciling two things that may seemingly on the surface be in opposition. This is about having a balanced viewpoint. So for you, this week is all about making compromises. Uh, maybe you were considering your position and now you're willing to make some concessions and you are advised this week to do so. That's the key for you, being moderate in your approach to all things. Uh, so you may initiate a conversation this week, a dialogue where you get to be honest with somebody, where you get to say all the things that are bothering you or try to clear up any kind of misunderstanding. And it's not that you will necessarily end up agreeing with this person or they will agree with you, but you come to this place where you make peace and agree to disagree. So just clearing the air, putting everything out in the open, uh, is going to improve a situation. And remember the Two of Swords, maybe you were holding back your emotions. You were trying to figure something out and get to the truth of something. So ha maybe having this dialogue will clear that up and give you some peace of mind. You will have to be careful this week, though, about being excessive, uh, holding yourself back by connecting yourself to people and situations that really don't serve you and yet somehow you're trying to convince yourself that you're doing it for your best interest or for the sake of somebody else. It could just be that a bad situation is just a bad habit and you're using that as an excuse to not do what you know you should, to not use your talents in the best way possible. Now, if you were feeling ill, if this had a connection to ill illness, then this is a week where you may find it difficult to relax. It could be something uh, that you're addressing that you don't quite understand, something annoying. Uh, this is going to be an important week though. There's water in this card and, and this sort of 
connection to alchemy. So your dreams could be very important for you this week. Uh, and you may have difficulty even focusing for some reason. You will have to try to discern what is true intuition and what is just your impulsive reaction to a situation because again you could say something or do something or even spend some money in some ways that you end up regretting and you do have that money card the wheel in the beginning of the reading uh, Ultimately, though, this is about reconciling a situation with yourself. And maybe last week you were going into yourself to give, to contemplate. You were being introspective. And so you may realize that the bar that you set was really you setting the bar for yourself, that no one else had the same expectations or demands that you thought that they would. And so that could be why it's important for you to have this dialogue and clear the air. There could be some revelations for you this week where you gain a new perspective based on some new information, where you become more self-aware. For others of you, you know, this is saying and possibly leading back to last week when you were giving some thought to things that your thinking needs to be more original. You may need to do something different. You may need to think outside of the box for whatever reason. 